education is is quite important to mankind. Education could be only one 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 keys yeah, for the success of of one persons or of our children or our next generations. So his mat first responsibility is or first duty or first contribution to the world to be the, the concrete thing is education. My name is Anas Amatiyakul, a member of the faculties of social science, Mahidon University in Thailand. And Mahidon University is considered to be one of the uh, top 10 universities in Thailand. In these uh, faculties, I'm in the Department of uh, Humanities, and this department offers some programs of studies just like uh, competitive radiance, radiance and development and ethics. As well as I'm also the chairman of the advisory council of Islamic Bank of Thailand. And this bank is the uh, government enterprise of Thailand. I'm a professor in Islamic history as well as I do teach uh, Islam and global politics as a visit, visiting professor to Thammasa University. So I have seen the, the downfalls of the Muslim world in the history. And from the Hizmat movement activities, I think that this is a one channel for the Muslim world as well as the Muslim nations to 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 revival to get revival uh, as I have uh, studies many of Muslims uh, organization on around the world from the uh, most eastern border of the Islamic world just like in Yunnan in China something like that in Indonesia okay in Malaysia, the Islamization in Malaysia to the end of the western border of Islamic world in Morocco and other. So there are, it's come to my knowledge, <coughs> many Islamic movement and organizations. But even in India and other places, okay. But the Hizmat movements uh, play a different role. It emphasizes mostly in education as well as uh, giving the importance of dialogue between civilization, cultures, and religions. So I think his may maybe a new hope for for Muslims. Okay. You see that any movement, any movement cannot be be cannot uh, achieve its goal without. Uh, through inspirations. And these true inspirations must be coming from from the from its own fountains, its own fountains. Okay. That these fountains contribute a rich of uh, ideologies, cultures, as well as motivate uh, its members. So this Sheikh Hoya Afandi is just like uh, the main fountains of these uh, activities that always inspire and contribute more things to the young generations of Turkey to serve the world. So I think the word his, his mat 
before I I I I I I I I I did not know the meanings, but I know Arabic. So it's just it's a Turkish form of the Arabic word khidma. So this khidma is, I think, is very 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 impressive word, and fit for the Islamic value to provide to the world nowadays. The world is maybe waiting for our khidma, or or waiting for the contribution of the Muslim nations and the khidma movement. Responsible for these value things. In my opinions, two important things uh, could be credited to the Hizmat uh, movement. First thing, the concrete thing. The concrete thing is education, service in education, in promoting education on around the world. But second thing is that. The move, the Hizmat movement, uh, struggling in in establish the the dialogue dialogue between uh, uh, different religious communities and civilizations. So the concrete thing that anyone can 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 touch, anyone can realize, is the Hizmat uh, activities and service in. The field of education, so from more than 100 countries in the world, perhaps thousands of schools that under the responsibility of the Hizmat movement, this is a is a concrete proof of its service to mankind, because education is is quite important to mankind. Education could be only one 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 keys. Yeah, for the success of of one persons or of our children or our next generations, so his first responsibility is or first duty or first contribution to the world to be the, the concrete thing is education. But the second thing, which is hardly to to realize because it's not concrete, is uh, the success in in bringing uh, different communities, different nations, different even different ideologies to come closer together, uh, to, to even to be friend from a very different world, just like the Western world and the Islamic world, to become friend. So for most people, most people may have idea that uh, the Western world. It's hardly to be friend with the Muslim world, but this is not true. Under the the activities uh, of the Hizmat members, that successfully uh, brought the Western world to be friend with Muslims. So I think this is a great achievement. It is uh, very very important for for today's. For the world today, is because uh, day by day the world develop into more conflicts, more serious, even more serious conflicts. Is uh, someone believe that from last four five decades that that in few years the world will come closer and become more friend, and the conflicts will be reduced? Okay. Or not, not, not even to to zero points, but we be lesser and lesser. But it proved wrong. Nowadays, conflict develop and grow more and more and deepen, and very sensitive that in any countries, conflict between between uh, uh, ideologies and 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 cultures could be easily erupt. Okay, just like uh, in in some places in Europe. Okay. Or even, or even in Myanmar, okay, or even in 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 in, in Thailand, it's also possible because of uh, the advancement in in social media. Okay, people hardly to 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 see such activities between different groups, between different uh, minorities. But now, anything, a conflict from from 
from uh, from within a very limit circle from uh, person person between few persons could be seen by by people all around the world so it may brought uh, brought to to more conflicts because there must be same nationalities in Europe in South America so looking that one of his member communities is being oppressed uh, being treated unfair in some other place so this will be very easily and sensitive to to create problems and and literatures and printed books could not be worked uh, to to equip in times but uh, this uh, religious dialogue or this uh, dialogue between religious and religions and and civilization will be will be the the, the most effective tool to bring to bring people to come close together and and to know each others and to be friends with each others. <laughs>